Hello everybody, I'm Nerd Guy, and the Deadpool test footage has leaked online. Um, if those of you doesn't know what I'm, what I'm talking about, there is a supposed Deadpool movie that has been in the works since uh, X-Men Origins Wolverine, which was a piece of shit movie that everybody wants to forget, partly because of Deadpool's role in it. Or, well, the first time Deadpool is in when Deadpool is in it as Wade Wilson, that's actually good. That is, Ryan, Ryan Reynolds acts like Deadpool would act, he talks like Wade Wilson it works. Then we come to the end, and it's Baraka. It's not Deadpool, it's fucking Baraka. Except, no, it's not Baraka, because even Baraka has a fucking mouth. Anyways, not raging on x men Origins Wolverine here, but the Deadpool movie. It has been in the works for quite a while, there's been no info about it, and now the test footage is leaked. And the test footage, it's all CGI, it's Ryan Reynolds as Deadpool, and I think he does a good job. Sorry. I'm gonna put a link to the test footage below, but it's very likely the test footage is gone by now. So, because Fox is removing all of it from the internet. They're trying their best and they're failing, but... Uh, I'm gonna put, like I said, I'm put putting a link in the description, so if it's still up, you can watch it. If not, basically what happens is, Deadpool sits on an overpass by the freeway, paints with crayons, and then sings along to Gwen Stefani's Hollaback Girl. And uh, then he talks, turns to the camera and starts addressing the crowd and goes like, Hi, I bet you wonder why I'm wearing a red suit. Well, that's so bad guys can't see me bleed. And then you see like the obvious bad guy van driving down below and he goes, Let's hope those guys are wearing brown pants. He just takes a step right off the bridge, falls right down, crashes through the sunroof, lands in the back seat and goes, Hola, me llamo Piscina de la Muerta. And everybody sits next to him and is like, What the fuck is going on? And then he turns to one of the bad guys and goes, there's no easy way to say this, I'm pregnant, Trevor. And then you just start wailing, beating the living fuck out of the guys one by one, kicks one guy out of the car, at one point he gets his face pushed up against the seat and he goes, hmm, rich Corinthian leather. And then he breaks that guy's head, neck with his feet. Then he sucker punches the guy in the passenger seat and goes, bitch. And then he goes up to the driver's like, scusi, por favor. And the driver starts elbowing him in the head a couple of times, and Deadpool just goes, ow, 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 and then just grabs the whole steering wheel and just makes a sharp turn. Which causes the car to flip over and start tumbling. And then in front of the car, there was a guy on a motorcycle who jumps off, grabs up, picks up a machine gun from him somewhere, and just starts shooting at the car. But then you see, like, a slow motion, the car slows down, and inside the broken sunroof, you see Deadpool sitting there with a the picture they made with the crayons, which is a picture of him decapitating somebody in the motorcycle helmet, and it just goes to this. And uh, then you see him reach, reach for his sword, everything goes up to full speed again, then you see car landing on his on all wheels, and see the window go down, and then you see the head of the motorcycle person, and then you realize, oh, it's the severed head of the motorcycle person, and that will place around with it, goes like, crime is the disease, and it jumps up from the camera, meet the cure! Well, not really a cure, more like a topical ointment that reduces swelling and itch. Hi, Tom! So I looked it up, and apparently Tom is one of the persons, one of the people at Fox who this was made for, and also Trevor, which he mentioned earlier. Now, what do I think about this? Well, it's fucking awesome, I left my ass off to this. It could be that I watched it in the middle of night, like, like 2 a.m., but still, it's fucking hilarious. And also, no, I didn't see it just now, I... I wanted to make a video about it earlier, but I already had a video for last Friday, so I didn't want to make. I don't want to just discard that video, and that video sort of belonged together with the one we made Monday, so I pushed this video up a bit. But yeah, I really like this footage. I mean, I don't know much about Deadpool. I don't read comic books, so yeah. But I have. I want to know more. I'm thinking about buying the Deadpool video game, and also uh, I watched an episode of Ultimate Spider-Man called Ultimate Deadpool that. Deadpool is in, obviously. Now, I don't even watch Ultimate Spider-Man, I just watched it because I want to see Deadpool. Because I want to learn more about it, because I find him interesting, he's a cool character. I like the whole breaking the fourth wall thing, it's basically like House of Cards. So, if they're making a movie, I really want to see him like talk to the camera, engage the audience. The one thing I would really love would be if, when he talks to the audience, the other people in the movie would react and be like, Who the fuck are you talking to? Like. There's nobody here. Who are you talking to? Because that's something that bugs me about uh, House of Cards. Is that he sometimes sits next to people and he just starts addressing the camera. And I'm like, that those guys should hear you. Um, okay. 
<laughs> there's a parody made by it's uh, it's made from a group of Swedes, and the parody is called House of Tards. Uh, it's in Swedish, but it has English subtitles. I'm gonna put a link to it below, so check check out House of Tards because that video is fucking hilarious, and it kind of makes fun of the whole like breaking the fourth wall, and everybody's around. Yeah, you get. I don't want to spoil it too much. But anyway, if they're making a Deadpool, I'm looking for. I'm gonna see it. And especially if it's like this test version, because this test version was, as I said, hilarious and awesome. I, I loved it. But, but honestly, one I'm gonna last, I'm gonna end it with this. I think that the people who released this test footage was the people who made it, because Fox has been just quiet about the dead movie. There has been nothing. It's been about as quiet as the Assassin's Creed movie, which they have released nothing about. Unless we know that Ma Michael. Michael, Michael, Michael Fassbender is going to be in the movie, that's it. And the same Deadpool, Deadpool movie. We know Ryan Reynolds is going to be Deadpool, but then what? Like, they, there's been nothing. So I think I think the company's called Blur. I think they released this Deadpool footage. I think they leaked it because they want what happened to happen. They want to set a fire under the ass, the collective asses of Fox to get this movie done. Because right now, Fans of the fans of Deadpool, fans of comic books are foaming at the mouth, crazy about seeing a seeing a Deadpool movie, and apparently they even have the script ready. And as far as I found out, the beginning of the script is him watching the Deadpool from X Men Origins, getting so upset with what he sees because how they portrayed him in that movie that he goes on a killing spree and then eventually gets bored and goes home. I would love I would love to see that. So they apparently have everything ready, but they haven't done anything. So I think Blur released it just to set a fire on the Fox ass, because right now people are screaming for a Deadpool movie. People desperately want to see this, and they do, but I'm not even half as bad as a lot of people are. So, have you seen the Deadpool test footage? What do you think? Leave your comments and tell me. Rate this video with a thumb up or thumb down. Subscribe if you like my videos. And, well, look me up on Tumblr at nerdyguyranting.tumblr.com. Anyways. I am the Nerdy Guy and you just watch Nerdy Guy Rant. Bye!